Hello, and today we are going to be doing our Spring 2022 Outlook. If you want to see more like this, like, subscribe, share the video, and why not throw a comment down below? Here is my overall forecast. Let's start off in the southwest, where it will be dry, even into Texas. And then the north of that is going to be flip-flop as the middle ground between the dry weather and the winter storms lingering in the upper Midwest and the Northwest. Some severe weather will be in the deep south as a primary area, where north of that it'll be rainy and stormy as the border between warm air and cold air is there. Some cold air and a late start to spring will be in the interior northeast with the coastal northeast being another flip-flop region. In the southern United States, we are going to be warmer than average. Some of the deep south in Texas is going to be well above average, well above average in some areas in the southwest, but significantly above average in the southeast. Here's my precipitation forecast. In the brown and oranges, you are going to be expecting some below average precipitation and then above average precipitation in the green regions. The deeper you get into it, the higher precipitation or the lower precipitation, depending on which color you are. Here's my severe weather forecast. There's two areas, one in the upper Midwest, where it's mainly going to be late in the season. And then we could be in an early start in the, e in the eastern portion of this area. An early start to the spring is inevitable in those areas. It works like the Storm Prediction Center. You go marginal, slight, enhanced, moderate, and high risk. High being pink, marginal being green. And then slight is yellow, enhanced is orange, and red is moderate. Traditional Tornado Alley will not have as much severe weather due to the possibility for some droughts. Additionally, I would like to also point out that there is the possibility for some tropical weather, some out-of-season tropical weather, this spring in the month of April, which will also be very active in the way of severe weather and tornadoes, as possibly the most active month for severe weather. In the light blue, you can expect a slight chance of an out-of-season winter storm. In the middle shade, you can expect a medium chance. And then in the dark blue, you can expect a high chance. Bye. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, like the video, share, comment, and if you'd like to hear more updates and get notifications,